watch and burn. Hey everyone. So tonight I want to very quickly discuss uh, Krista Berg's, I think it's a 1995 release and it's called Beautiful Dreams. The main reason that I wanted to discuss this record quickly was this isn't so much a proper full length or an EP. This is a collection of songs that everybody from his fan base should already be familiar with that he has chosen to re-record using the sort of old school method of having everything done at once without any modern sort of editing or the ability to use studio magic and things like Pro Tools in order to sort of create the perfect take of the vocals and then the perfect take of the bass and then the perfect take of the drums and then they assemble it all together. Every single song on here, which includes Carry Me, Missing You, and of course, uh, Lady in Red is on here. And my personal favorite, which is The Snows in New York. Every single one of these tracks has been recorded the way it used to be, whereas Everybody, everybody playing every instrument, every vocalist, everything goes at once, and the song is performed 100% from start to finish the way it was before modern technology made everything really simple. It's like that episode of The Simpsons, the InSync, you know, studio magic it makes Bart and everybody sound like InSync. Krista Berg chose to use none of that here, and he did it the way that they used to do it way back when, whereas everybody just played the song, and you had to get it right, or otherwise you had to start the entire track over again. So that's what my favorite thing about this is, is this is, like I said, a bunch of songs that his fan base are, or should be more than familiar with, that they have been re-recorded in the old style of recording that shows the, the talent and the musicianship and the care and the concern that DeBerg and company put into each of these tracks. And their ability to sort of pull them off in one take is really impressive. But yeah, that's all I really wanted to talk about, mainly just because I love this take of The Snows of New York. Like, I love that song. The studio version is rad, but I prefer this version because it, it does feel bigger and more cinematic because of how it was recorded. So yeah, so I think I'll leave it there. So thank you so much for hanging out with me. And this time I actually succeeded in keeping this quick, in quick, sorry, quick, quick. Um, yeah, so thank you for hanging out with me while I discussed Krista Berg's, I think it's his 1995 release, and that is Beautiful Dreams. Like always, if you like this review, don't forget to do something nice for somebody. But please, most importantly, do not forget that the world is a better place because you are in it. And I'm going to go because it's getting dark out here and I have to kind of hike my way out. I was at this public park. It was really cool. If I think of it, I'll put some footage up. But getting in and getting out are kind of a nightmare because there's absolutely no lighting here whatsoever. You can't really see it anymore, but like right behind me is a park and there's no government lighting. So I'm going to go. Have a good night.